On the Lower East Side is a building from the 1800s where walking through the doors is like stepping into a rainbow. Cotton boucle, boucle with sequins, with paillettes. We have with mohair, we have with ribbons. We have embroidery starting from things like this, which are very funky. I love it. Wool with some lycra. The best for suiting. This is brand new collection. It actually just came in this morning. I'm Alice Goldberg. This is Mendel Goldberg Fabrics. We're on Hester Street in New York City. I grew up in this business from the time I was a child. This business and building has been in our family. Um, I'm the fourth generation. My granddaughter, Eliana, Beautiful. made this. This was in 1940, and this business started in 1890. Wow. And this is the actual store with my grandfather, Alexander. We have the original skylight in the mm -hmm. 1890s. There was no electricity. In order to see in the basement, you needed a skylight. When I came into the business, I did what I knew, which was high-end couture fabrics. We have quite a collection. I will say that I buy for this store like I buy for my own closet. I don't shop price. I only want the best <laughs> because the best will certainly is always good enough. Hand painted tulle with Swarovski stones. There is a fabric for every client. I believe now that we can hit almost any budget. Tell me what the process is like for a customer coming in here. Is it often individuals? Is it businesses? We have home sewers, hmm. which I love to work with. We have couturiers. We work with the Broadway shows. We work with the Met. We have designers that buy cashmere for headboards. I believe it's easier for the client to be able to see the goods, mm -hmm. how it moves, how it's gonna drape. We're doing curtains for a yacht. Wow. And this is gonna be perfect for her. We do a lot for bridal and we have excellent seamstresses that make up the garment at different price points. I feel like I would get inspired working in here every day and seeing all the colors and textures. And I love it. <laughs> in fact, <laughs> Lewis always says when I go on vacation, he says, you're going to last three days. Three days. <laughs> Lewis is like family. Lewis, you've been here for 30... 32 years. 32 years. I've known a lot of the customers. Yeah. And then as soon as I walked in, hi, Lewis, how you doing? <laughs> what, what's new? What, what do you got for me? And just show him all around. Juliana, she is just fabulous. What to yeah. you sets this place apart from other garment stores? The personal connection that Alice has to all of her customers. And I don't think you can find fabrics this unique anywhere, anywhere else in the city. Is there anything in particular that the previous generations passed on for how to run this business? The respect and the regard for mm -hmm. the client. I think that's the most important thing in the business. That's mm -hmm. what my father taught me. You never judge a customer. Everybody gets treated the same. The legacy, what does that mean to you? I'm the daughter of the owner. Sorry, this is very emotional for me because it is my father's business. I walk in here every day. I feel the legacy of my family. And I try to make my father proud.